Uh, what turn is this? This is... Last two turns! Uh, let's see, what do I need? I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, geez, I need a big number. Let's go for it! Literally go for it, because I got a four. Her, her. Oh, congratulations on your star, Luigi. And while well, Luigi also gets a four, we're just so in sync. Yeah! Luigi activates the genie, because why the heck would he not? Well, at least you get to see the genie again, that's always fun. Mr. Luigi, my green head coward buddy, I'm on the job, you big kebab. You ain't never had a friend, never had a friend, you ain't never had a friend, you ain't never had a friend, you ain't never had a friend like me! I don't stinking know. Next star is all the way back over there, which I'm not gonna be able to get unless I get a magic lamp at the last second, and it's the second to last turn, so I can't buy one, so it ain't happening, so let's just wreak havoc like I like to do, I suppose. Uh, thankfully, can't afford. Why would you use that? I don't stinking know. Okay. Somehow that's gonna come back to bite me in the butt, but. Let's see, <laughs> I said butt, butt. Butt, butt. In the what? Say butt, butt. In the what? <laughs> Four player minigame. Uh, Stamp out Toad's uh, Mr. Blizzard's Brigade. That's a new mini game. I thought Stamp out was a battle mini game. I don't know what. Okay, whatever. Uh, I just remember it being a battle one. Apparently not. Uh, Mr. Blizzard's Brigade. You just run around the frozen pond while avoiding the snowballs thrown by blizzards. You just move around the schooly thing and hope not to get hit. It's weird. If you get hit by a snowball, you turn to a block of ice, which is really seeming weird. The power of snow. Hello, snowman. Do you want to build a snowman? No. Insane. I just I don't know why this has been the musical number of this uh, LP, or maybe I'll just like continue onward. Who knows? Uh, there was Wario. Oh jeez. So now Wario is an obstacle that we have to deal with. Eventually, the big snowman will wake up, and he's gonna be a very big nuisance for us. Come on, Luigi, get frozen. Get frozen. You know you wanna. You know you wanna. And there's even more like Mr. Blizzard's coming through. Come on. Uh, get frozen, Luigi. Just hurry up and get frozen. I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. Come on. Uh, Luigi, why are you so difficult this time around? Why are you so difficult this time? There you go. And like how the snowball just explodes in his hand. Get all the corns. Luigi has two stars. That's not fair. Unless it is fair, in which case, I'm just angry. <laughs> Last turn, what can I do? What's love got to do? Got to do, I just had to shove another song in here. Uh, let's see what we got. Nine. I don't know why I didn't use the Mega Mushroom, I don't think there's anyone in my proximity. Oh hey, that's why, Klepto. Uh, map. I think I have five more spaces. It was a uh, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's the mushroom. Uh, let's see. This takes me over here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, I'll go with you, I guess. One last ride with Klepto. Do we get the magical volcano in the last turn? That'd be pretty cool to see. Uh, maybe it's only when the shy guys are crying. Then yeah, that would probably make more sense. Only when he's crying, then the volcano would erupt. See you later. Eh, nothing really important, though. And Luigi, you're gonna use that legendary war pipe? No, you just wanted to have it with you, so you could, like, teleport back home after you lose so terribly to me for the second time in a row. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully things will turn out okay for me. We're in second place, but I got confidence that we'll be alright in the end. And we're ending off on a repeat minigame! Hooray! Paratrooper Plunge. Uh, do I dare sing another song for the road? Even though there's no road, we're going through the sky. There ain't no road in the sky unless it's a rainbow road. That is the road that you go. 
I don't know what the fruit I'm going through. Let's just keep on going. And woohoo! 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 If anyone gets the reference of woohoo, like there's so many things I say that like people probably don't even know are references. Just the way I say words is a reference. Pretty much, I'm the most unoriginal human being ever. I'm more unoriginal than the LPR who has unoriginal in his name. Hi, Chris. Um, I'm just like so singing unoriginal. Like everything I say is a reference to someone or something, and people will either get the reference and be like, oh hey, that's a cool reference, or they'll just think I'm funny because they don't know what it is. They just think I'm naturally funny when I'm actually not funny at all. I just take things from other people. And then there are people who think I'm a ripoff just because I quote someone. Hashtag not bad. 23 coins! Oh, one more, and we would have gotten 24. With 220 coins, geez, I think we got the coin star, no problem. But do we have the entire game? Let's find out. So, um, you done? Well, okay, see you guys. Uh, okay, let me tell you the results. First, let's check the number of stars. We got 0112. Almost like A113. Number of coins. Gee, I wonder who has the coin star. I have no idea. And the bonus stars. Each person receives a star. First, the minigame star. For the minigames, Jungle Star's minigame star is. Daisy! I don't know why, but like, on the screen, it always seems like Davy. Davies? Daisy's eyes like shift over to the right or the left or whatever. It just happens on this screen. I don't know if it's like happens other places, but this is the place I always notice it. Uh, it disappeared. Next is the coin star. No uh, person who collected the most coins. Gee, I cannot possibly uh, guess who that's going to be. It's Daisy. And finally, the happening star is the most happening, happening dude in the entire town. It is Daisy. I wonder if Daisy will be a winner this time around. And um, here come the final results. And the winner is Rocky, I mean Daisy! I'm the party star! I'm the party star! Whoa, party star! I like how Waluigi's so singing until they shows up in our celebration pose. Next. Detailed results. Pulling them on over here. I don't like the Toad's always the one next to me when I celebrate. I want Boo to be next to me because Boo's the coolest. Uh, detail results, what do we got? Jeez, I absolutely sweep it as always because I'm playing on easy, so there's no real challenge. But whatever, we gotta get through them regardless. Hopefully the commentary is entertaining all the same. Congratulations, Daisy. So, um, here's the present I promised. But the rules say... Wow! You have to beat me at a minigame! Look how happy the shy guy is, just so happy bouncing up and down. I love this animation, it's just so stinking cute. Alright, whatever, enough talking about cute shy guys. Let's go into the box of magicalness and play Legends of the Hidden Temple! Yeah, you thought I was being, like, silly with all the... Legends of the Hidden Temple references, and by all of them, I mean like the one that I made at that one point. Uh, let's have an archaeological guess match. Want to hear the rules? Sure. One of the five spinning blocks will have a unique shape. Use the squiggly thing to move under the one block that doesn't match, and then press A to hit the switch. Pressing the switch lets you choose that block. You get a point if you are right, but if you get crushed, if you're wrong. You can get three points before I do, then you win. So um, let's start. Pretty difficult minigame, actually. Let's see if I can do it on the first try. Gee, I wonder which one's the different one. <laughs> I think I was trying to say, oh, this is a difficult minigame, but he's first when getting to it. Okay, so that's sort of an unfair advantage he had right there. All right, a little cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Uh, what do we got? Uh, this one? No, it wasn't that one. Oh, wait, no, 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 I know that, no, no. Wait, it was that one. That was the one in the top left. Okay, got one, that's good. 
Uh, gee, I wonder. <laughs> oh wait, no, it was that one. What the fruit am I doing? Oh god, I might actually lose this. You gotta, if you lose this, you gotta start the entire board over again. Oh no. Uh, it's this one, right? Okay, good. So it was actually a close match this time around. Here's the challenge that you've been waiting for this entire time in the Mario Party universe. Uh, this one? Oh wow, that's unfortunate. Yeah, at least we get to see the little shy guy dance again. Um, that's too bad. Oh, you made her cry on her birthday. How sad. Would you like to try a shy guy again? Yes. Thankfully, you do not have to play the entire board again. You could just play the minigame again. It's very, very simple like that. Don't worry about it. I just like the name of this, the archaeological guess. <laughs> yeah, he's like, oh, I guess. It's sort of like kind of a joke of Shy Guy because like, he's just like, oh, I guess. And gee, I wonder which one's the different one. I guess the real challenge is just getting to it because sometimes it could just be closer to the other opponent and you have no chance of getting it before they do. Unless they just mess up, but they usually don't. Uh, this one? Oh god, I did not think it was going to be that one. That one! Uh, Fooey. Is this one? Yes, it is! Okay, cool. Got two before he did. Let's see if we can just get one more. Uh, this one? There you go! He's so happy! Congratulations, Daisy, and so, um... Magical teleporting... not teleport, magical... Stroller. Here's your present. <laughs> I don't think I know. What I do know is that we just got... Daisy's Table! Uh, but wait a minute, all the other items are in the... Uh, party room already, so what's gonna happen to the stuff that was sitting on the table? This ought to be funny. <laughs> He's just like, oh! Please just be floating midair and it'll just clip through it. That'd be stinking hilarious. And... Oh, it's not sitting on the table. Oh, that's unfortunate. We'll add Daisy's table to the present room. And with that, we have finished Shy Guy's Jungle Jam. Next time on Daisy Party, we going to Vegas, baby! And it will not be while I'm high on, uh, dental medicine. Maybe, possibly. I might consider it. We're gonna go to Goomba's Greedy Gala. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night. And we are here in World 1-3. It's an underground area and I adore this song. You may remember some of these songs in Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Brawl had like a lot of stinking Mario Land remixes, which is kind of interesting. Uh, we got Piranha Plants, which, oh hey, it's the newest Smash Bros. character. I don't even know what to say about that, so just not even gonna try talking about that right now. I, I'm, I'm excited though, I like Piranha Plant. Uh, hello, we got like these traps coming out of nowhere, so it's just creative looking as opposed to the original Mario Bros, which is just Block City, and hello. Got a secret area right here. Uh, is it? I could have sworn- oh yeah, I was like, yeah, they got coins in here. Not completely crazy. Just gonna break these and these and these. Uh, I wonder if you run fast enough then you could just run across here. Yes, you can! That's why they kept those, uh, other three blocks over there. Uh, they remained and whatnot. That was not a sentence. I don't know what I'm- what sort of lack of LP skill drugs I'm on right now. Uh, Lucy, can you, like, not stick your head in my bag? Uh, I got a cat recently, by the way. A lot has happened since then. Uh, since last time you heard from me. Uh, I have a cat named Lulu, or Lucy, or Lucy Goosey, or Lou. Uh, she's very adorable, and I adore her so, 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 so much. But, yeah, no, she's just like, I'm gonna annoy all the recordings right now. I have not recorded in a long stinking time. Uh, so a lot of the LPs that have been getting released have been, uh, backlog recorded. Uh, just getting back to the swing of things, I suppose, but... This right here, uh, the fire flower that I, uh, still gotta talk about. As you saw, as you saw before, it, uh, collected coins whenever you threw the ball, which is really cool. 
So, that may, may not make a whole lot of sense. Why is a fireball pick up coins? Well, in this game, it is not just a fireball. This is a super ball! Yeah, that's the official name for it. You're not collecting fire flowers. It's a super flower that gives you super balls. So, you defeat enemies with your superiority, I guess. Uh, I don't really know what to make of that, but whatever. Uh, jump up here. Uh, but yeah, you can collect the coins with it, which makes it very, very uh, convenient. And, and I like how they just bounce all over the place. They aren't, they're not just uh, retained to the uh, ground. It's a lot more fun. Like, it just, it takes such a simple concept and changes one little thing, and it makes it a million times more enjoyable. Uh, I was never really a fan of the original Super Mario Bros, but uh, this makes it, like, an infinitely more enjoyable experience. So I can't really go back to the original Mario Bros now. I just want to play Mario Land! Okay. Oh, geez. Uh, can I jump on you? And we're unfortunately back to minuscule size. We have two lives, so I don't need to create a safe state just yet. And hello, it's the Sphinx! And he dies just like Bowser. Or we just make the jingle happen. There's a 69 in the timer! Yay! I like how he just explodes. He has, we don't destroy the bridge. Pressing the button just makes him explode. Thank you, Mario! Oh, Daisy! Oh, Daisy! No, it's not her, of course. But yeah, for those who didn't know, this is Princess Daisy's first game. She appeared in Super Mario Land as the damsel in distress. The story is that she was kidnapped by an alien named Tatanga who wanted to marry her. And we need to put a stop to that. Hey, I actually did it correctly for once. Three lives. All right, now into World 2 now. I don't know where Mario got this UFO from, but whatever. Another very awesome song. I don't know what this uh, area is based off of what specific world, but Hi. whatever. It's just gonna keep on going. Gonna keep on making our groove. I don't know if, like, I apologize if I get cut off mid-sentence because of the way I'm cutting up all these episodes. Like I said, I don't know how I'm incorporating this into the Mario Party 4 LP, but it's gonna happen whether you like it or not. Uh, we got a mushroom. We got, uh, excuse me. Go in here and I did not mean to go in there. I just saw a bajillion stinking coins that we missed. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, we got our super flower. Not really in it for the high scores. 69! I'm in it for the 69s, apparently. Uh, just gonna go over here. Could we get, uh, oh wait, I was gonna say, like, we're gonna get fried fish or fish sticks or something like that, but no, we, uh, do not have the power of fire this time around. It's the power of superness. Oh, uh, so we're gonna have, like, super fish, super squid? I don't know. We're gonna have failures, what it seems like we're having. Uh, jump up here, hit the block, get the mushroom. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna try not to like obsess over the music in every single level, but it's so stinking good and it honestly gets better and better as time goes on. Uh, just jump up here. So yeah, uh, I just I also like how the invincibility music is just can-can music. I don't understand that. I guess it's in the free range of, I don't know what is the free of copyright land. I'm the best at speaking guys. I just did a marathon for extra life where I spoke for 12 hours or whatever. And I was a talking master, I was so good at speaking. Uh, oh jeez, seahorse of death. Okay, get on there. Let's see, oh no, because we're small, we can't get that block, darn it. Probably has a fire flower or a one-up or something like that. Or, no, a heart, excuse me. Gotta remember the official names, nothing in there, okay. Get the coins, there is nothing for us here. That's lame, but we don't need no power-ups, we could be super all on our own, maybe. Do -do 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 and we're bad. Wow. Hooray. 